Hi everyone, my name is Lauren and welcome to a new video. In this video I'm going to give you a long awaited island tour of my current Animal Crossing island. This however is not my finished product, I would call it more of a work in progress kind of tour because it's definitely not what I want it to be and I want to start landscaping properly soon, move everything around like all the buildings. So welcome to Helix everyone! And before we start this video, I would also like to request if you could like this video and maybe subscribe to my channel. When you enter from the airport, the first thing you see is a little post sign, which is really cute. Ooh, some stones. I'm gonna just quickly warm these ones and put them in my little pocket. So there's a cute little fountain over here and a cute little flower area and so on and so on. So I'm gonna start by showing you the area on the right first. Um, at the top is the shopping district which we'll go to in a bit and then welcome to our little zen garden I want to make a cute little like bakery stand where you can buy like baked goods So when we get to the beach there is a teacup ride which seemed really fun There's some palm trees, ooh there's um, some butterflies flying around I would describe this kind of as like one of those piers where you have loads of like rides and stuff And then you can go and like snack over here which sounds really nice Alright, let me take you to the shopping district. This is where our little Nook's Cranny shop is, where you can sell your turnips at a crazy price or a really bad price. Today is really bad. Um, and I did loads of like little landscaping with flowers and stuff. As you can see, some of these are still growing. Um, this is where the Able Sisters shop is and you can buy some snacks too. So let me quickly introduce you to some of my islanders since they're out here anyway. First of all, I'd like you to meet Pango. She says, I had an idea. Let's see how many more times we can talk to each other today. <laughs> She's really, really sweet. Then this is Hamlet. He's the cutest little hamster. He loves working out. <laughs> he calls me Iron L. I don't know why either. <laughs> then when you go down here is Charlize's house. Oh, she's not home at the moment. And then when you look up there is Selena's house, who is my housemate in real life. Um, she also lives on my island and she grew some tulips, it seems, and put a little telescope outside, which looks really cute. Oh, there's loads more flowers. Cute little pond. And then when you run down here is the other beach area where we're currently growing loads of bamboo shoots and um, flowers. <laughs> and here you can relax in a hammock, which is the wrong way around. Listen to some tunes. <laughs> and then over here, as you can see, more snacky stuff. It's a really cute area. I really like this area. So then when you walk up here past the shopping area, um, on our left, actually no, let's go right first. Let's go right first. Up here is another tiny little garden where you can chill, listen to music, um, there's a little bird's bath, um, and so on and so on. Um, I do want to incorporate all this stuff with the Japanese Zen garden um, at the bottom because I'm really not happy with how this looks. And then here obviously is our city hall or like the main square um, or the customer services building and Leaf is visiting us! We love Leaf! He's so cute! <laughs> I put loads of little like instruments everywhere for all of the animals to play with and to sing along because I love seeing them sing. Gail is so cute. This is Charlize by the way, she's dozing um, so I don't want to wake her up actually if I do this is she going to wake up? No, it's not waking her up. Ooh, I just got 5,000 bells, hello, thank you very much. <laughs> so over here is like waterfalls, there's nothing much going on. This is kind of like one of those areas I haven't done a lot with yet. Um, however, this is my orchard, which currently doesn't have any fruit in it, but I have every single fruit apart from oranges. So if you have any oranges, let me know, I would love to have some oranges. Cool. And then when you turn left, here is our museum, uh, which looks absolutely horrible and messy, I know, I know. Um, but it will become a really epic place in my next version of the island 100% So then we get to my little house. This is my house. Welcome, welcome, welcome Loads of flowers which are definitely taking over and I built this nice area for myself out here um, Kind of like a jacuzzi I would say Cool, let's cross this bridge now and go down here There's a little well, a picnic area um, and then some clothes that one of our animals has hung up. This is where Sherb lives, so let's go and say hi. Sherb is adorable. He's one of my favorite islanders for sure. Oh, he's currently doing some DIY stuff. So let's ask him, see if we can get a recipe of him. All right, let's leave Sherb to the um, DIYing. <laughs> let's go. And then we go to the left. This is where Felicity used to live, and now Epony lives, I believe. 
And then down here is Gail and she's my absolute best friend in Animal Crossing. I literally want to marry her. She's freaking adorable. I think she's amazing and she's so, so cute. We love you, Gail. Look at her. So yeah, then we just have beach areas. I didn't really do that much up there either. Um, and this is kind of a fishing area at the moment where I wanted to build some kind of picnic or I'm not sure yet. Right, let's um, jump across here Ooh. Ooh. and go up here. Um, I haven't done too much with this area either, but this is where Lopez lives. He was our first celebrity, I think, to move in, so I gave him like his nice neon pool and a flamingo and stuff. <laughs> oh, he's exploring the island. Well, I'm sure we'll come across him at some point. And then this is where Anka lives. She's an Egyptian cat. Let's see if we can go and say hi. She's also not home. Wow, everyone's out today. And then over here is where Kiwi lives. He's on the right over there. I gave him this little bath because he always calls me itty bitty baby, which really annoys me. He's a monkey. Um, I know not everyone's a big fan of monkeys. I'm not either. I'm just really irritated. He always calls me like itty bitty baby. So that was my little thing to get back at him. <laughs> then we come over here and there's a cute little path with some flowers. And this is our campsite area, so you can chill there by the fire, um, bristle marshmallows, then grab a little snack if you want. This is a clay furnace, so in my head it was kind of like a pizza oven, I guess. And then you can just sit here and enjoy, enjoy your time, I guess. Then I'd like to introduce you to um, my newest area, which is what I'm currently working on. However, I'm going to change everything, but at the moment this is what we'll have to do. So I put a little lighthouse here, and Apparently someone new is moving in, which is very, very exciting. I wonder who it's going to be, um, but we'll find out soon enough. So this is my house. As you can see, I've got some turnips <laughs> laying around. This is my turtle. His name is Gary. And yeah, my house is um, pretty swell. Nothing much going on yet, um, but I'm hoping to change that soon. Then this is my bathroom, and I'm really happy with my bathroom. <laughs> I know it's not like super aesthetically pleasing, but I think it looks really cool. <laughs> look at it look at all the fish moving on the walls it's just so cool can we sit on the toilet I've never actually tried this no I think it would be very cool if we could interact with all the items like get into the shower um, you know whatever all right guys I'm so sorry but that's already the end of my quick island tour because I just don't have that much going on yet I'm very excited to just basically dig everything up and build waterfalls everywhere and just build like Mount Everest here and there and then just Neverland hovering in the sky and you know, very realistic island plans. <laughs> right, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure that if you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and you subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more. Oh god. And I would absolutely love to see you in my next video. So have a lovely day guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!